ladies, so today I have a review of the stamping plate that I got from BornPrettyStore.com. It is BP08 is the number of it, and it's got these really beautiful um, full nail designs. This one's like a lotus flower, the stars with vines, flowers and vines, this beautiful intricate butterfly, um, like another kind of lotus flower, and like mint leaves. And um, I think it's just really cute. I thought I'd go ahead and show you guys how that works. So I have two coats of this gorgeous um, Cy Hansen Extreme Wear color that I just hauled recently. And it is number 240, Bay Blue. And um, gorgeous color, uh, two coats. And then I will be stamping with the black Conad special polish um, and I have the squishy stamper from Queen and I have a store card to scrape with and I also have a hundred percent acetone I get this from Walmart and some lint free wipes because and I have this is just a layer of paper towels and then a towel underneath so that I don't get acetone everywhere because it sucks because <laughs> it'll you know it'll eat up your desk Okay, so it has a blue film on top. You can see all you do is just peel it off. And then I'm just going to take one of my lint free wipes. Um, I got these off of Amazon, they actually work pretty well. And just going to get some acetone going. And just wipe off the plate, make sure there's no like, you know, anything on there. And stamper. Make sure, you know, nice clean surfaces to start with. Ready? Oh, sorry, let me readjust this. Alright, sorry about that. So um, I'm just going to do uh, probably one of everything on this, just to, you know, show you that how all these are. And, um, bornprettystore.com, you know, ships worldwide for free, which is pretty awesome. And, uh, I really love their products. So I think I'm going to start with these beautiful, um, flowers right there. And it's like a full nail design. Trying to get it how you all can see it. There you go. And just take the polish and scrape. And look at that. Look how intricate. Absolutely just gorgeous. Alright, and I will put that along the middle finger. I'm just going to kind of roll it. Kind of gently pull away. Wow. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I just love that. Really beautiful flowers. So, um, in between each one, you want to wipe off your stamper and your scraper. Get some more acetone on this. And uh, you want to wipe off your plate really well and your stamper. Alright, and next I'm going to do some of this top. And just Throw some on there. Wow, look at that. That is abs that's breathtaking. And I will do that along my thumb. And I'm just going to push into it. Wow, that's gorgeous. 
out. Look at that. It's like a gorgeous, like, tribal. Wow. I love that a lot. Really nice. Really awesome. And, um, you know, these plates are very inexpensive, especially if you uh, catch them on sale or anything. Right? So just wipe that off. And then I think I'll do these stars. Aren't those pretty? Right? Get that out of the way. Screw it over you. There, that looks better. Bloop. There you go, another perfect image. Gorgeous. And I will just press that on my index finger. Um, kind of straight. Just kind of pressing it down. But that is, I love the stars. How cute that is. Let me find back up a little bit. And then the thumb. Right. And um, this is kind of long. I just want to show you that um, how all the images work. Because um, I've had some plates, like more inexpensive plates. Some Im images work, some don't. Um, right. And then now I'll do the middle, the lotus flower. Right there with all the background around it. Alright, look at that. Gorgeous. Right, and um, I'll just put it in the middle of my ring finger. And uh, with Conad stampers, um, the non-squishy ones, you need to roll it. That's why I like this plain one, because you can just push down. There we go. Uh, my nail isn't quite long enough to see the lotus, but it also leaves like a really cool design. Super cool. Alright, and for the pinky... Um, Probably do the butterfly on the bottom. Really intricate and beautiful. Oops, that was a lot of polish. Oh well. Oops. Wipe off my. Oh wow, look at that, that's gorgeous. Wow. Alright, and I'll do like... Right in the middle of it. Alright, gorgeous. Alright, so all I'm going to do is let these dry a little bit longer while I do my other hand. And then I will be back to top coat it and show you how to clean it all up. Alright, so I just finished my second hand, which, you know, took a whole total of, you know, two minutes. You know, which is awesome. So, um, I just did the same images on each hand. You know, the stars on the index, then the flowers on the middle, the lotus on the ring, and the butterfly wings, which are really hard to pick up. But I will have some still pictures because they are really intricate and beautiful. So I just have my cap, the can of my acetone. I'm going to pour some. Then I have a brush somewhere. 
I have like a small, you know, like inexpensive brush that you can get off eBay. Just going to dip it into the acetone and just clean up. You can also use a Q-tip, um, anything that you use to clean up. Those, you know, like nail polish corrector pens, which are really awesome that I wish I had. <laughs> You can also use um, scotch tape to clean up around it, but um, I think just using like acetone or just nail polish remover would work really well too. Alright, so all I'm doing is just cleaning up. And um, some of the black polish remains, like um, where it like spread out a little bit, but whenever you wash it off, it'll you know come off the skin. All right, that's probably boring, but um, all right after I finish that, I am just going to take my top coat. I use sesh feet, you can use any kind, you can even use just like a clear coat. And um, with stamping you want to be careful um, not to smear your design, so you go over each area once and only once. I usually start at the middle, and go to the sides, and cap the tip. And uh, it didn't smear, which is awesome. That's also because, um, you know, that's the special stamping polish. It dries quickly and it doesn't have that much of a chance to smear. Unlike if you use like a um, Sally Hansen color to stamp or something like that. Alright, so just kind of quickly going through. Alright, and I am all done. Um, really pretty. I will finish cleaning up the cuticles and I will have some still pictures. So I want to thank you all so much. Um, I bought this plate on my own. Um, it's I just need to clean it off. And uh, I will have the link below. And I want to thank you ladies so much for watching and I will see you